I'm going to shuffle some cards and I'm using the Light Seers Tarot tonight. So basically, then think of a situation in your life where you'd like some guidance, just one situation. And then when you've come up with the situation where you want a little bit of guidance, think of a number one, two or three. And once you've chosen your situation and your number, then I will collect some cards and then I'll give you some guidance. So first things first, think of your situation. Right, you've all got one. Now think of your number. Okay, anybody who's thinking of number one, send your energy to me now. Oh, gosh, right, we'll save them then. Anybody who's thinking of number two, send your energy to me now. Number one, stop. Okay, and then anybody who is, has chosen option three now. Okay, oh, very nice. Right, so option one then, whoever chose option one, uh, we had two cards jump out. So you've got the Queen of Wands and you've got the Hanged Man. So the Queen of Wands tells you that... Um, you in this situation, yeah, you in this situation, you are the queen of this situation. The queen of wands has earned the right to be queen. Some of the queens are married into money and things like that. But in this um, suit of the tarot, the wands, she's passionate, she's confident, she's earned the right to be the queen, she's um, she's caring and everything, but the point is you have to own this for what your situation is for you to succeed and you to get the outcome you want. You have to be the queen of wands, but the queen of wands in this situation is quietly confident because the card that jumped out with it is the hanging man. Now that is where you just take time to see the situation from all angles. So it's have a different perspective than the one you've got right now. Take your time, but own it. So that's how help, that's helpful. You must see it from all perspectives. It's, there's a perspective you've not seen it from. And it's until you actually see it from that angle, it won't fall into place. Okay, option two then. Oh, the Empress. Lovely card. Whatever your situation is, you've already won. You've already done it. You've, you've succeeded. She's very successful. She's abundant. She's also pregnant, not necessarily meaning you're going to be pregnant, but maybe you've got the birth of an idea or you have to start a new project or you want the project to be successful. It will be. So the Empress worries about nothing. She's like all four queens of the deck rolled into one. Um, to succeed as the empress you to believe it absolutely believe it the job's done i am abundant i'm sorted it's as easy as that as the empress okay so option three then you've got the six of wands which is the great card tonight this is the card of victory so again you've succeeded but in a different way things seem to fall into place here with the empress i'm the queen of wands but with the empress You've been instrumental in the outcome with the six of wands. I suppose you have really, but it kind of falls into place because of your passion. Maybe it's been a previous fight, but it all falls into place and you and you are victorious. OK, so it's, it's more about the situation there rather than um, who you are. So I hope that's helped. It's just a bit of fun, really, while everybody comes in. <laughs> 